tell by looking at this photograph on the wall that the advancements in hearing aid technology, they've come a long way since the 50s. And here with all the details is Chuck Alt, who um, is at Beltone. Thank you for hanging out with us. Yeah, thank you, Heather. So, okay, technology has come so far with um, advancements in helping people hear better. But let's talk first warning signs when there may be a problem. Yeah, a lot of times a, a person doesn't realize they have a hearing loss. Other people tell them about it and they, they don't believe it because they can understand somebody like me, but they may not understand somebody like you and just think that you mumble or drop off at the end. But it's somebody, always somebody else's fault, right? It's somebody else's <laughs> fault. So if other people seem to mumble, then that's a sign that it could be a hearing loss. If it's just one person, maybe they're mumbling, but if it's everybody, you could have a hearing loss. Well, and it's also, hearing loss can also be misdiagnosed for other things as well. So it's definitely something you want to get checked out. You want to get it checked out. There's a lot of consequences of uh, hearing loss that's not checked out. If you have hearing loss and it's untreated, dementia can set in quicker. Um, the hearing loss doesn't cause the dementia, but the onset can come faster. Yeah. Falling and things like that are connected to hearing loss, too. So uh, lots of um, advancements in technology from the way that hearing aids have um, come. So we're going to oh, yeah. go check out a few of those options and see um, what's available now. Okay, very good. So here on this table, we have a few examples of hearing aids and how they've kind of evolved over time. So let's talk first about this one. Tell me yeah. how this one is um, well, different. The, okay, this is more of a, a basic hearing aid that everybody probably is familiar with. And you have a volume control, and so you're in control of how loud and how soft it gets. And that's about all you can do. Uh, where it's different from something you can buy over the counter is this has been customized to your hearing loss So it's amplifying exactly what you need, but your control is only with the volume Okay, and then we later came out with um, Push button it has the volume control and it also has a push button So if you went to a restaurant we could put a second setting on there And when you went to the restaurant you just push the button and you could hear better in the restaurant and then after this uh, of course, I wanted to point out all of them using batteries and where, where the technology is going now is into rechargeable batteries. So you don't have to buy batteries anymore. Uh, this came out uh, with an eight hour charge. Um, so you could put the hearing aid in, it, it takes care of charging it, and then in the morning you just go ahead and put it on your ear and wear it for the rest of the day. Now we've come out with something that's uh, a little bit more intelligent or advanced in the sense that the, the charge that we have lasts 30 hours instead of eight hours. Wow. And there's uh, a completely sealed unit here. This unit, you can still put batteries in. This one, the battery is contained, it lasts over four years. Oh, wow. This battery has to be replaced every year, once a year. Okay, so now we can download an app and across the top, there's the different settings. Uh, this is for all around, all situations that you're in. If you go to the restaurant, there's the knife and fork. Um, so it goes to, to the setting for uh, the restaurant. And then if you're outdoors, there's one for outdoors. If you're at a lecture, um, and this is a good one to illustrate with. Let's suppose you're listening to a lecture and you wanna hear everybody who's talking. You can push the button and it will change the hearing aid to where it brings in everybody. Now I know some uh, people don't like a lot of technology and so if the uh, hearing aid person has a son or daughter who has a smartphone, then they can download the app on their smartphone oh, nice. and they can adjust mom and dad's hearing aid. Well, that's exciting. Something else exciting. Tell me briefly about the artificial intelligence coming soon. That's coming soon. So one of the things that we can do with our app is if you went to Texas Roadhouse and you adjusted the hearing aid the way that it's perfect for you, where it got rid of the background noise and you could understand the person across from you. You could save that setting. Every time you go to Texas Roadhouse, it will remember the settings that you saved and will switch to that. Where the artificial intelligence comes in is the hearing aid will be able to determine if you're in an atmosphere that's just as noisy as Texas Roadhouse and automatically switch for that kind of environment. So it's a brand new thing coming out, but it's it's about to be announced here. Something to look forward it to. Yeah. Okay, and you've also got great promotions for veterans. Yeah. How does that work? 
Veterans uh, and their family members can get a 30% discount on any of our hearing aids. And uh, that's, a, that's a pretty nice um, discount to get. Yeah. Also, Farm Bureau members can get the 30% uh, discount also. Nice, okay, and if people wanna learn more, maybe they're interested in getting up to date with technology in their hearing aid, you've got several locations across Central Illinois. We do, we do. here in Champaign, Danville, uh, Watsika, Rantoul, and Bradley. Wonderful, and all they have to do is go online to your website, and plug in their zip code, and they'll find the closest one. That's exactly right. <laughs> that's exactly all right, right. Chuck, thanks for having us out here. Yeah. So cool, lots of great advancements um, to help people with their hearing loss. Yeah. So Thank you, Heather. Making it simple. If you need any more information about this new technology, maybe you're a veteran, maybe you're a member of the Farm Bureau and want a good discount, we'll have all that information at stayliving.tv.